All right, Daniel, so we're going to focus on um, some lumbar stability, specifically loading that left hip. This is typically an exercise we'll do after we release the spasm in your left hip. So I'm going to have you put your fingertips on that box. And this can be a box, a wall, whatever you got, something that they can stabilize with. You're going to keep up nice, uh, lift your chest there for me, good. And then I want you to just lift that right foot just a touch. That's it. And your muscle in that left hip is going to have to work pretty hard to maintain that neutral pelvis there. And then we might hold that for 10 times and do that 10 seconds. Go ahead and relax. And then to advance this, I want you to pull that right fingertip off that box. And then you're going to go ahead and lift that foot for me again. And again, we might do that 10 times for 10 seconds. And then the ultimate advancement would be no hands. We're not going to do that right now because that's pretty tough to hold the balance, especially if you haven't practiced. Um, and then to move on, Daniel, go ahead and put both those hands back up there. We're going to work on tapping that left hip to the left. So if you can imagine there's a wall right next to you, go ahead and lift that foot a little bit. And then you're going to just tap your hip to the left and then right back up. Tap it and right back up. It's almost like a modified hip hike. But that left hip, Dan, you can probably attest, is burning pretty heavy. Oh, yeah. And I might do that 10, 15, 20 times, whatever we can take. Good. Thank you.